This man was a mason. He took up the tools of reverence and compassion and virtuous rules. When he was admitted, his first test was prayer. He knelt and committed to honor God there. And while resting his hand upon the good book, he opened his heart and our vows he then took. Kneeling amid brethren, he promised to give his best beneath heaven, a good life to live. Since then he has traveled on life's rugged road, and he must have struggled with many a load. That sometimes he stumbled, there can be no doubt. He must have been humbled more than we may count. For though Masons aspire to be right and true, we can falter and tire, as all creatures do. So we have not judged him, that is not our place but rather we've loved him with trust in God's grace. Now his tools are retired, his labors have ended. To the temple on high he has ascended, yet his spirit is here as well as above, in our memories so dear, in his works of love. For this man was a mason, he took up the tools of reverence and compassion and virtuous rules.